Hello my lovelies and welcome to Sondering Tarot. It's time for a daily tarot reading for the 4th of December. And since I'm in the mood for Jack Skeleton, we're going to use the Nightmare Before Christmas. Let's see what today's energy is. Oof, I don't pull my tapestry all over the place. And this is not just very good, which is a good thing. I mean, what does the collective need to know? for the 4th of December, 2022. Oop, that tried to come out and didn't. What does the collective need to know? Oop, got cards sticking together, hold on. Okay. Six of presents, seven of presents, and the Empress in reverse. Make sure they don't win any other cards. Okay, let me get further in here so you can see this. Bring it back into frame. So, Six of Presents, Six of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, and the Empress reversed. Now, if the Empress is in the upright, I, I would say this would be a highly creative, um, productive day. But we have the Empress in reverse, so it kind of makes me wonder if you're not seeing yourself as being on top of your game. If you're maybe lacking a little bit of confidence, some self-assurance, some self-worth. Because it's like we've planted seeds and we're, we've got rewards or, or effort that is shown for what we've put in. And you know what? I'm, I'm curious as to why the Empress is in reverse. Perhaps there's a blockage. Spirit, can you clarify the Empress in reverse for me, please? Spirit, clarify the Empress in reverse. Ooh, and that slid. Hold on. I have to chase cards. Ten of Cups. King of Wands reversed. Ace of Wands reversed. And the Two of Wands reversed. Hmm. Okay. So we're not as motivated or passionate. It's, yeah, like we're, our happiness, our creativity, our passion behind it is not there. So 
So I guess you could call it a creative block in a way. It's like we want we want to produce things uh, of high value, but that drive, yeah, the creativity, the passion, the motivation is just not there no matter what we do. You might feel a little stuck for the day. Six of presents, six of pentacles here. What you put in, you get out. It, it, is the juice worth the squeeze? And if we're at a very little vibe here, like if this is depression taking over and we just feel like we're stuck in a rut or, you know, we want to have a lazy day where we're just in our PJs, laying in bed, watching Netflix, <laughs> we're, we're not going to get a lot of done. So expecting rewards or, or productivity from that is not going to really happen quite so much. However, we, we do have the what you put in, you get out. And, and we do have the seven of presents, the seven of pentacles here. So planting seeds getting something back you you can still get something out of it even with low energy today it, it's like getting the maximum amount of productivity with the lowest amount of energy required I will say with what came up for clarifying the Empress in reverse, if some of you may have some mental health issues, some anxiety issues, some depression issues, etc. Or um, you know, creative blocks if you're an artist or if certain chakras are not flowing freely, those are things to address. At the same time, please remember not to focus on the negative. It could be that some of this you're focusing on the negative and you're not seeing what you can actually get out of a situation. So the situation may be good, the situation may be productive, but you may not be able to see it and that's because you have something interfering. So please remember to let good things come your way and try to see the positive side, even if you don't feel like it. Hmm. Sounds like it might be a little bit of a tough day for some. Yeah, if I'm right, all these add up to 16, which reduces to 7, which is the number of the mind and creativity. So for those that are creators, artists, having a creative block is going to be a big obstacle. Um, I wish you luck. If you feel comfortable enough to... Share that experience down below. Go for it. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.